Hey y'all, and welcome back to The Pink Envelope. Today, we're gonna be playing with and unboxing a brand new to the channel box. This is the red box of mental wellness. Um, I thought the timing would be really good. I know the holidays inspire all sorts of thought processes, but they also trigger uh, all, all sorts of thought processes. And so I wanted to bring in an option of a box that is a subscription box, but they're also offering a holiday pop-up box that we could look at. So we're gonna dive in, open this guy and see what's inside so that we can have a better understanding of what the red box of mental wellness is doing. They actually have five different subscription box options. I will try to pop the photo up here so you can see those. But they start as low as $5.99 for a digital copy and go up to $49.99 for the entire premium box. So still very affordable. Uh, it is a monthly option, but you can do one-time boxes if you want. Uh, if you use the coupon code PINKLOVE23, you're going to get $70 off this exclusive holiday self-love box. But if you just wanna check out the subscription, use Pink Love and you get 10% off plus free shipping, which I think saves you around 10 bucks. So I have coupon codes for both boxes. I'm not unboxing the subscription box today. We'll have to show that at a later time. We're gonna show the holiday self-love box because we only have like, what, a month and a half left before we are in the holiday Christmas season. Y'all, time is flying by. Every time I go to list a date or something with you guys on here, I like stutter because I feel like I'm saying it wrong. Okay, this self-love box is $298.97. It has free shipping. This box ships December 15th and is only available for ordering up until November 28th. The first 100 people who order the box get a free gift with it. That's pretty cool. And then that coupon code is a mega coupon code. It gives you $70 off the box. And I know that this subscription box is for people trying to live a more balanced life. This is not a beauty box, but a self-love, self-care, books, journaling, adult color therapy and DIY project box to inspire mental wellness. So we can dive more into the actual subscription box at the end for those interested. Let's dive in here and see what this self-love box is filled with because this is a giant box. Also, it's very heavy. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to slide it down here because there is so much inside. Look, I'm already pouring it out. Oh my gosh, on the top, can you see how many book spines are up there? Here is a little thank you card and more about their community and how to get social and hang with them. Then there's a little thank you note on top. Thinking, oh, there is a thinking of you card, like an actual like card card. And then information. If you're in crisis, here's a number that you can text. Uh, there's information about Compassionate Hearts United Foundation. And then there's information about the self-care love box here. Okay. On top is Inspirations, an 18-month calendar that goes into 2024. Um, my daughter is super into calendars, my youngest one. She said it makes her feel very, like, not in control. That wasn't the word she used. I guess, like, aware, aware of her date. When she gets her date, she can look at her school things to do. Like, she gets up first thing in the morning and looks at it. So I may be saving this and giving this to her for Christmas, because it's small, it's manageable, and look at the pictures on the back. All things that most people would love, especially a kiddo. Very cool. A gel eye mask. I'm gonna pop it open so we can look at it. I love eye masks. I sleep in an eye mask every single night. I swear by them. Oh my gosh, this is in the color purple. Going back to that same daughter. This is her absolute favorite color. It has the gel beads inside, but on the back, it's that soft, like fuzzy, not, not even fuzzy, it's just soft. It does have an adjustable strap. It, can you microwave it and chill it? Let's see. Okay, it is a cold therapy bag. Are these good for headaches? I feel like somebody was saying 
the pressure of these plus the chilling aspect is good. And then you're supposed to put your feet in hot water. I mean, I've never tried it. I was just reading about it because I get headaches. Uh, fast soothing relief for allergies and eye discomfort. I love it. Great color. Okay, the 90 day anxiety journal and the minimalist art coloring book. So both of these guys are in here. This one is more activities, exercises and prompts to overcome anxiety. So this is what this looks like here. And it looks like you can like kind of record about your day so you can keep track. But then like, I don't know, let me see if I can find one. Flip. There we go. At the end of the month, you can make evaluations, it looks like. So it's a full like quarter's worth of tracking, which if you've been watching my videos, I've been talking about that recently. It doesn't matter if you're journaling uh, like this to track a pattern in your living, or if you're journaling so that you have the like wherewithal to know where you've been and where you're going, which I guess kind of could be the same thing. Um, journaling's the best way to do it because we have a tendency to forget where we were and how far we've come. So that's cool. Then this is a coloring book, but I like it because it is minimalist. It's not, you know, I feel like every time we see adult coloring books, they are extra, like super intricate, crazy. And I mean, I guess this one is a little bit intricate, but I like this style of coloring books way more than like the stained glass effect where you're having to color all those little things. Sometimes that's a bit much for me and that like <laughs> spikes anxiety. Whereas this seems very attainable and achievable to do in one setting while listening to music and having a tea or something. Oh my gosh, there is so much stuff. I'm gonna have to speed up a little bit. I wanna play with all these things, but we will be here for forever if I don't. So speeding up, we've got Trust Your Intuition, A Guide to Living Your Authentic Life. So we have a book here. I don't know if these have retail values on them. I haven't been looking, but I'll put this right here with books. We'll kind of stack and get, we'll get grouping so we have everything together. Is this like a little back scratcher? It is. <laughs> These do oddly feel really, really good. Something about the texture of this. Let me shorten it so I can do my shoulders. Oh my gosh, but I'm a sucker for a massage. This feels so good. Look, I'm getting goosebumps all up my arms. Uh, yes, please. Nightingale. Oh, tea. I was just saying to get one of these and do tea. There is an entire box of tea in here. There is a lavender soap. I'm gonna take the cover off so you can see the soap better. For bathing, I love lavender. I love, love lavender. It, I don't know if it's psychosis or if that's why it's lavender, it really does work. It makes me feel so relaxed. I don't wanna burn a lavender candle. That's not as much my vibe as lavender soaps. Uh, lavender essential oils, lavender linen spray. Yes, please. Sometimes you forget you're awesome. So this is your reminder. Okay, so when you first open it, it has sticky notes. The side has a pen. And then when you open it, it's just pages, but it's little. So like you can throw it in your purse and keep it and travel with it. Very cool. Self love shower affirmations, 20 affirmation cards to use in your shower. I have seen affirmation cards of all shapes and sizes, but this is my very first pack of shower affirmation cards. Very, very cool. There's 20 of them in here. I'm actually not gonna open them just due to time, but they are fabulous. What is this green thing? We have a green pen that says never give up, a green bag, and a smart, strong, fearless, Stress ball, I love these things. I could sit here with a stress ball and squeeze it. Actually, you probably should. It'd make your forearms like really strong if you consistently did that. This is a bottle of Gent Leaf Lavender Body Lotion. Very cool. It looks like it's a cute little bottle that it's in. So we've got two lavender items which also match our sleep mask there. And then I am seeing a lavender bath salt that goes with it as well. So I'm gonna put this with our little lavender collection. Super thankful they didn't send like a bunch of different scents. That would have been super weird. Cause look, here is a lavender bath bomb that totally goes with the theme. And that way if you like have a bath, 
soak, and then you wash your body, and then you put lotion on, you don't smell like a triad of things. That really is a pet peeve of mine. Oh, there's even lavender wax melts in here. Very cool. If you don't have a wax melt thing, I don't have a wax melt thing. I take a candle that is empty and throw them in there and just put it on the warmer thing. I have like a candle warmer that I use once a candle's burned through its wick, but it still has scent left and I don't want to give it up. I just transfer the candle over there. Once the scent's gone, when it's hot, I pour it out and then I put those in. Super easy. Aileen's Clear Gel Tacky Glue, a premium crystal clear adhesive. So one of the things I know that this box does is not like a bunch of like woo woo, like, like chants and stuff like that. Although they do incorporate some of those things, they do DIY crafts that are to inspire you to get up and move and to think and process while doing small tasks. So I'm guessing there's something else in here that that goes with. Biscuit Sensation, a delightful assortment of six fine European cookies. We have a snack in here. Very fun. Oh, of course. Well done. Let me get this guy open. She actually provided us the wax melt like base right here. Very, very cool. Okay, so I feel like I'll just do this because this technically goes with this little collection here. And here are one, two, three, four, five tea light candles that go down here that create the heat, that melt the wax, all to create that whole experience of like natural burning fire with the scent. Anxiety and stress amethyst bracelet. So this bracelet is amethyst and it's a protective stone and it relieves stress and anxiety and soothes irritability, balances mood swings and dispels negativity. I feel like I need to give this to my preteen daughter. This could be something that may work miracles for everybody in the family if she started wearing this. What is this? Oh, let me get it out here. It's like the gel mask, but it's a gel roller. So I have one of these that's smaller that's like the crystal stone. I can put it in the fridge and I'll pull it out and like massage, it feels so good. This one's like back shoulder, like the real relief with this guy here. And then what is in here? Oh, the stone! Let me squeeze it out right here. What is it, the gua sha gua sha stone that you hold and you can massage out? This is what this one looks like right here. And these are great for like pain relief and stress relief. I use my thing like on my for my face, it's smaller and it, it is remarkable how something that simple feels that good. I've never learned the art of this guy, but it's on my list of things to do. So both of these are included in here. Nowhere did it say this is for women and I absolutely think anybody could subscribe, but now that I've gotten it open and we're seeing a few of the items, I would definitely say it targets females, preteen, teen, and women more than it does others. We have a Zen gardening kit. It includes a book and a Zen garden. So here's a little book on Zen rock gardening. And then there's the base. Look at the little rake right here to rake. And then here are your stones in your sand. I'm not gonna pour it all out but everything you need to set it up and then how to use it in this guy right here. How cute. Same effects as a Zen garden without taking up all the space. I've never seen a mini Zen garden. Oh, and every day, Olive Squalene Skin Balancing Mask by an amazing brand that we see around here often. Highly recommend these. I love, love, love these. I was using some of their under eye gels two nights ago. These are great. We're still going. I told you there's a bunch of stuff in here. It's like very impressive amount of stuff. Oh my gosh, a DIY miniature living room set that you assemble. It also has like a little LED light. I'm not gonna open this because I feel like we're gonna lose the pieces but it is not finished and it has everything you need with instructions on how to build it out and then put acrylic over it so that you can display it when it's done. 
that's cool. Looks like a little Ikea house. And actually the art on the wall matches this coloring book like a lot, a lot. So I'm wondering if that has to do with that. Okay, we have, oh, more lavender. A lavender shower gel in here. I'm gonna put it with our lavender family. A lavender bubble bath in here. A lavender bath oil in here. I almost didn't see this little guy. Shower steamers. I love shower steamers. I just put a fresh one in the shower last night because we got the house all clean yesterday. There's eight shower steamers in here. These are fun because you can toss them down there and usually they last like a week or two and they smell so good through the whole bathroom. And then we have, oh wow, 72 colored pencils with a container. Okay, let's open this. I think I can slide this open pretty easily and show you. Oh yeah, that's so pretty. I love colored pencils like this. What is, you've got Mel. I would send you a bouquet of freshly sharpened pencils if I knew your name and address. There's something about them, they're charming. And these are used for your journal and your coloring book. And honestly, when you're reading this book, you probably can make notes in there and mark and highlight. Okay, comment below when you're reading a book. A paper book, obviously, Kindle's a little harder, although you can notate things in Kindle, it's harder. Are you one who writes? It can be a book, it can be my Bible. I write, mark, highlight, draw, notate. I love it. So when I pick it back up later and read it again, I can read my notes, I love it. Sometimes I write a memory, sometimes I write a cross-reference or just highlight something I really need to remember. So I am a book Bible marker. Okay. Let me dig through here. I don't want to forget anything, although, oh my gosh, so much. Okay, I think that's it in the box. So this is the Holiday Self Love Box. It's $298.97 for math's sake, because I'm terrible at math. I'm just gonna call it 300. But with my coupon code, you get $70 off which makes it $230 for what I counted to be about 31 products. 31 products that like, this is multi-use, this is multi-use, this is a consumable, this is a consumable. So I feel like it's a good mix of stuff that you will consume and use that you enjoy so it doesn't pile up, as well as things you can use over and over and they have more of a shelf life. Uh, everything seems very on theme. I think that this is gonna be a great hint as to what comes in her subscription boxes. Cause I would have guessed that this box is made up of inspiration from those five different subscription boxes she offers. And in those five different subscription boxes she offers, she has the mental wellness and self love box, which is the premium box at $49.99. Then she has a DIY miniature house. So like this guy here, self love project box. Then she has an adult coloring stress relief box. And then if you don't want to get the physical box, you can get the digital copy sent print at home. And then all of those can be snagged down below. Both coupon codes are listed down below for you to peek at as well. And uh, the mental wellness and self love well box come with five to eight items like you're seeing here. She did tell me that they are working on more personalized support. So when you subscribe, you actually have support with one-on-one -on -one meetings and things of that sort that is to come. They are also currently creating a mental wellness digital course that subscribers will receive for free with the box purchase. And so I think that is another really great thing. It's more than just stuff. She really wants to pour into all of us seeking healthier mental being. And then she works with a nonprofit where they donate to military caregivers that are caring for disabled military veterans. 10% of profits of every monthly self-love box goes to Compassionate Hearts United Foundation. So she's kind of putting her money where her mouth is, curating support for us, but then giving back to make sure that she is pouring into others who were pouring into others as well. This is a brand new to the channel box and we swung in with a bang with all of this stuff. But if you have questions, please put them below. I could always contact the owner and say, hey, we need a little more help before we dive in and subscribe. Uh, I've talked to her two or three times. Super kind, super easy. You can go check out her website, grab the URL down below. Okay, you guys, this is one of 
many amazing unboxings coming. I really want to dive in and show you guys these things. So as you meet people, you can share it with them, or maybe you'll find that this meets a need you currently have. We are still working on the Pink Envelope website. We are in beta launch, and we are learning so much as Jonathan and I are like the developers behind this. We have a guy that's helping us, but we are doing it all. So make sure you go check out that brand new website, which has the subscription box directory and all the unboxings on there. And if you find anything crazy, email me or comment on the Ask the Pink Envelope private Facebook group and let us know so that one of us can go in and fix it. Uh, we figured we'd beta launch it just right here with you guys, get it working, and then we'll blast it out to the world. So go check out that website that we are so proud of. And then make sure you subscribe to the channel. We have, I can't even begin to tell you how much is on this list of marker boards. And then directly behind you, the piles of boxes in my entryway is unbelievable. So we have some really, really cool stuff coming up. I'm hoping that you find stuff that meets your needs, but I'm also hoping that I supply answers for gift giving struggles that you may be encountering. Make sure you check out our holiday gift guide, which just launched for more tips and tricks. All of those boxes are our tried true favorites and ones we think you should check out uh, per category for him, for her, for the family, food and drink. We got it all. I hope that you guys are having an absolutely beautiful day. And if you subscribe to the channel, I'm going to see you guys later. Bye y'all.